Alright, welcome back everyone to another Tech Zone video. I'm going to show you how to create a fake error message box using Notepad or create a, a simple Visual Basic script in uh, Notepad. Okay, that was the one. I just want to delete it. So, yeah, so you can do scripting without Visual Basic or C++ or C hash or whatever. You can use Notepad instead, but it's much complicated. But the code I'm going to teach you is really easy and you're not going to have pretty much a problem with it. The code will be in the description. So let's open up Notepad. It works on X XP as well. XP Vista 7. I want 7. So here's the code you will need to type in. X uh, equals MSG box open bracket speech mark. Now type in the description of your message. You have a virus. Ha 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 ha. Ha. Okay. Comma. Uh, now, what I'm, the number I'm going to type will identify what type of mes message box you're typing. If I type 0, the buttons that will display is OK. If I type 1, OK and cancel. If I type 2, abort, uh, uh, retry, and ignore. 3 is yes, no, or cancel, and 4 is yes or no, but I'll put 0, plus the type of icon they will display. 16 will show a critical message icon, 32 will display a warning, 48 will display a warning message, oh my god, it's 48, not 148, will display a warning message, and 64 will be info. So in this case, I put 16, uh, comma, speech mark, your title, error, whoops, wrong spell, okay, speech mark, bracket, let's test it, go to file, save as, uh, save as type all files, desktop, let's just type whatever you want, dot vbs. Visual Basic script. Save it. Uh huh. Made a mistake. Rename. Actually, type that in. Yes. Now let's check. It. There you go. You have a virus. Ha 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 ha. You know how it goes. So let's edit this. Now I want to put multiple message boxes once I click OK. It's easy as step one, two, three. Let's just change the description. I was just joking. And title would be Haha. This time the buttons that will display is okay. I'll just leave it like that. And the icon will be a warning message, 32. Then I'll highlight, oops, highlight that again. Just copy like that. And I'll just say, no, seriously. And the title will be, I mean it. Let's cancel out of this, save, let's open it. Haha, <laughs> you have a virus, ha ha ha. With the uh, critical message icon, okay. I was just joking, with a question mark. That means this message box has no idea what it's saying. No, seriously. Uh, let me see if I can change the icon. If you can change the icon, then you can sort of prank your friends. No, you cannot change the icon. You will need to use Resource Hacker, which is a free program where you can change the icon of this. But I'm not going to show you that now. So that's it. That's how you do your first scripting basics. And hope you enjoyed the video. If you didn't, watch to subscribe for more. So thanks for watching, and have a great day.